All right, the Chargers are now the talk of the NFL after that dramatic come from behind win last night. The Bolts are going to the playoffs for the first time in five years. Our tennis reporter John Horn explores the complex set of emotions this is causing here in San Diego. At Cali Comfort Barbecue in Spring Valley, it's like the Chargers never left. This, the reaction after the Bolts took the lead over the first place Chiefs on Thursday night football. As a Charger fan my whole life growing up, last night result is what I've always wanted. We always expect them to lose those kind of games. San Diegan Sean Walchef owns Cali Comfort. His restaurant packed with Chargers memorabilia from years past. He also has season tickets to the team's games in Carson. What can we control is things that we like to be happy about. We love cheering on our team. We love interacting with other Charger fans, and that's something we're going to keep doing. The Chargers are going to the playoffs for the first time since 2013. And now the question for San Diegans is, will they unpack those old jerseys they thought they'd never put on again? They're kind of dead to the world. Tim Hoover watched the game last night, happy for the players, but it stung to see the success come in L.A. Many San Diegans still resent owner Dean Spanos, who moved the team after a failed stadium vote in 2016. The players deserve it. Spanos is no. John Velarde didn't even know the Chargers had a game last night, but he used to catch them in person and at watch parties, which his friends no longer hold. I'm upset, obviously, that they left because uh, we've always watched them. Love them or hate them, many in San Diego can't avert their eyes. John Horn, 10 News. And we wanted to know how San Diegans were feeling about the team's success, so we did this scientific poll. About half of respondents said they're happy the Chargers are succeeding. The other half, they are bitter, they are angry, <laughs> or something else entirely.